it's a little bit too early right now. Um, it's actually noon, but um, I haven't had my milk tea or, you know, some sort of caffeine. So I probably look a little bit groggy right now. This is my typical breakfast. I just eat this and I don't eat anything else for another hour or two. This is my almond milk tea, by the way. And uh, if you're interested in how to make it, I'll leave a link over here. Maybe this video would be a double whammy because some people ask me, how the heck do I use so little paper towel? Well, I use it according to how much I think I'm gonna be using. This is a bit too big for my mouth, so I just tear off, you know, rather than half, this is already a half piece, right? It can go a quarter piece or one eighth of a piece, which I do for breakfast because it's not really that dirty. It's just like, you know, just a little bit of peanut butter that I might get on my mouth. So I just go, mm -hmm. you know, this is it. So really, I just tear it according to the size that I need. Some people might think this is extremely frugal and, you know, why are you doing such a thing? I don't know. It just doesn't uh, bother me that much to only use what I really use. Anyhow, today's video is really about me not paying for a cellular phone plan, which could cost anywhere probably like a hundred dollars a month for most people. So it comes out to be what a thousand dollars. Now, as far back as I can remember, I think I haven't paid for a cell phone plan for over 10 years. So you do the math is about 10 K right there. Um, add in compounding interest or whatever, it's a lot more. So how do I not pay for a cell phone plan? My default is to just use the Freedom Pop thing. They give you a half a gigabyte of data for free and that's basically what I would ever use. Um, you used to be able to get it to one gigabyte. Uh, you get 500 megabytes of um, extra if you connect to a whole bunch of friends and family. Now you can no longer do this and there used to be a trick where you can connect with random people and then I was able to get one gigabyte for a couple years but now they shrinked it back down to 500 uh, megabytes so then it's gonna be a little iffy because I do actually use almost the one whole gigabyte so I, ha I would have to cut back if I were to uh, keep on using the Freedom Pop thing. My Freedom Pop is also on my iPhone 5 and uh, lately I think due to the latest uh, OS update. After I updated, it, it's gotten a lot slower. So slow that it might take a few minutes to boot up. Um, this is absolutely ridiculous how, you know, things can slow down so much. It basically uh, nearly killed the phone. It's basically dead to me. It can sort of work for very, very basic functions. Like if you want to wait 10 minutes to get one email or something. Yeah, sure. So you see on the table over here, I actually have four phones. Now, you know, pack rat, right? Um, I have a whole bunch of phones and they're for different purposes. Um, at least I didn't pay for any of them, except for one of them because um, no one's gonna give me a, a international phone, so I had to buy this myself. So I have this phone, which is basically useless. I only got one month service or something. Um, I did a review of this phone service, uh, but basically this is sort of dead unless I wanna just use it on Wi-Fi. Uh, it's an LG G something, G6. This is an iPhone 6 uh, with eight gigabytes only on it. And this is hooked up to Unreal Mobile and I did a review for them. They gave me this phone. They also gave me, I think one year's worth of service. So I have maybe six months left on this thing, but because I have this phone, um, well, and this one, I can use either one of them because um, I'm not stuck to a particular phone number. Now a subscriber, Murray N, gave me this uh, Mint Mobile here. Let me read it for you guys. Hey Francis, sorry this is late. Activate by uh, January 10th or it'll become inactive. Totally slipped my mind after. Came back from Vietnam. I hope this give you something to review for your channel. Meanwhile, giving you five gigabytes on the go data. By the way, it's for three months, actually. Keep it up, can't wait for the channel to reach one million subscriber. I believe in you. Best, Murray N. So thank you, Murray, for sending this. Um, it boggles the mind of you know um, how generous you are in sending this. Do note that I do have uh, cellular services. So whenever I'm reviewing something, um, I'm actually not, you know, I don't actually need it. I'm just reviewing it for the sake of reviewing it and uh, not actually using it. In this case, I actually did switch over to using this mint thing for uh, two months now. I have one more month left. And actually I was super 
please with the service. Five gigabytes every single month, I forget how much it is. It's like $20 a month or something. And the thing that really interested me is that you can actually turn on a hotspot. For Unreal Mobile, you cannot. So for Mint, you can, which means I can actually use my laptop with this phone, use the data from this phone. This is like a game changer and very, very um, important feature for me personally. So out of all these services, um, I'm currently not paying for anything and nor have I paid anything for the past 10 years. Uh, having the iPhone 5 sort of, you know, kind of dead, I think I'll have to work something out in six months when the Unreal mobile phone uh, runs out of service. This Mint thing is going to run out of service in one month. So I don't know, maybe I might um, go and, you know, sign up for this Mint thing. I am not sure. When the time comes, I will decide then. By the way, if you guys are interested in um, this mint thing that I might get, okay? I'm not sure if I will, I'll have a referral link down in the video description below. This phone, by the way, is my international phone and it's very, very necessary. When I go travel these days, you don't wanna bring a whole bunch of maps. And these days, I feel like it's absolutely essential that you buy a SIM card service, buy some phone service for the duration of your stay. Then you have, you know, internet access everywhere and you can access, you know, reviews on various places you can instantly know where to go you won't get lost you will find the interesting places uh to go to so to me it's totally worth it ever since i um actually buy the service i always you know try to use it as much as i can and i do get a huge benefit from maximizing my time whenever i am traveling so thanks for watching this video don't forget to give me a like push that subscribe button and ring that bell icon thanks for watching